Hey guys, welcome back to another Hacker Rank tutorial. This tutorial is over strong password. It's an easy uh, string based algorithm. So, as you can see, uh, you've probably already looked it up, but if you're not familiar with it, it's a problem with five flags. All of them we can do with regex. Well, four of them we can do with regex, and the last, uh, the length, we're going to do a different type of flag. So, let's just dig into it. So, the first thing we're going to want to do, since we're setting up flags, is create a counter. Anytime you're dealing with flags, you're probably going to end up having boolean or uh, a counter to either, you know, handle your flags. Um, and then we have five um, flags. So, we'll just set up five if statements here. And then uh, return counter. Okay. So the first one that we want to do, I guess, is if it contains a digit. So if if it contains a digit, we'll use regex from this. So and and we're gonna say uh, not right, with an exclamation mark because we're doing this in case uh, if there's not a digit, we want to count. I probably just like made the wording so more confusing than it needed to be. All right, so oh, so when you're doing regex, you want to have these slashes. So slashes look like that. D. Okay, that stands for digits. Cool. All right, then the next one's gonna be uppercase. So let's just do it. So it'll be these slashes like this and it'll be A through Z uppercase um, and then like that and then dot test password you kinda get the hang of this after uh, using regex if you're not familiar with it I encourage you to start using it obviously but learn how it works because some of the times you can just like guess what the regex is if you really started using regex so where well, this is uh, the lowercase, if you're wondering uh, what this is. Doo -doo -doo. Cool. And uh, let's see, what do we have? Lowercase. Oh, and the special characters. Uh, so let's just set this. Uh, let's see. This is gonna be kind of hard to write out. I'm trying to remember how I did this. I remember there's in parentheses. So if it's not part of this, um, okay. I think that's how I did this. So it's not, yeah. So you need to uh, parenthesize the entire statement if you want to. Um, have like a breakout tag for special characters. You'll see what I mean right here. So these are the special characters they need. Okay, so let me show you what it does. It'll break out right here. It won't in in an IDE. It will put another dash right there. Now that counts up. Then the last one is if the password is not greater than six. So it's pretty simple. If it's less than six, then uh, we talked about this earlier, right? So if the password length is the overall flag that fails, we want to use it. So we'll say six, which is the minimum password. Um, not length, and and that that will uh, provide the correct numeric every time or integer every time because no matter what, I mean, even if you have like if you don't have like uh, an uppercase or a lowercase, 
it'll still fail with length. So, either way. Um, and we'll also want to add, uh, let's see, if, or and, we want to add the same thing up here. So, and then it's greater than counter. And that's it. As I nervously wait for it to go through, even though I just did it. Yeah. All right, guys. Yeah. So check this out. Um, minimum number, strong password. This is the solution using regex. Simple uh, regular expressions. I mean, you could, if you even wanted to, you could do this right there. But I prefer using digits. I don't know. Because, um, yeah. All right, thank you. Have a good day.